is nice. The name has a nice ring to it. Um, it's definitely something I've imagined for the last year, if not three years, since Tokyo. So yeah, I'm just super happy that it all came together. I don't think it's quite sinking yet. So, give me a few more hours, but yeah, it was really, really fun. You know, in sport, you can do all that, and sometimes it doesn't even come together. So to have that happen and get through each round safely, I just wanted to make sure I was in that final. That was great. And you also have a sense of relief. There was, I did feel like there was a bit of pressure going into it, and managing that, it's a kind of a new position for me to be a red hot favourite. Um, but yeah, I'm just glad that I managed to live up to that title and take what was rightfully mine, we'll say. We've never had a semi and a final back to back before. Usually there's always a day off between the finals, so I could definitely tell I'd raced the day before. Um, so I was all about just trying to keep calm, recover as best I could, and all the girls were in the same position, so it hurts just as much for all of us. Um, but yeah, no, it was just, I just wanted to go out there and put, give it everything. If I gave it everything, I knew I couldn't be really disappointed whatever the outcome was, but thankfully it was enough for the girls. The National Lottery have been, well, they're a huge part of Team GB and obviously British Athletics, and yeah, they helped, well, they helped me do this full-time, it's my full-time job to do this, and it's down to the players that you know, play the lottery and it goes into, the investment goes towards us, and they had a big part in our holding camp, the food was incredible, the facilities were incredible, everything was amazing, so yeah, every time you play, you help support one of us, so it's great.